hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel today i will give you a tutorial regarding how to create a water droplet effect in adobe photoshop it's a very simple process so let's begin the tutorial so guys we'll start the tutorial by opening the record file and this is the image where we'll be adding the water effect as you can see that the leaf is empty but we'll be adding some water droplets out here so the first step is to create a new layer and select the brush tool and make sure that you select the hard brush and I will just click on it here so I will be creating these five water droplets the next step is to apply some layer style to layer one so we'll go to layer style and select the blending option and blend mode will keep it normal opacity 100 fill opacity will bring it down to 0 then we'll select bevel and emboss style will keep it inner bevel technique will keep it smooth depth will remain the same direction will be up size i will increase it to 30 soften will remain 0 and out here i will uncheck the global light first then i will put the angle value 30 and altitude i will keep it 70 highlight mode i will keep it a screen and color will be white and i will increase the opacity to 80 shadow mode i need to select screen and the color will be white then i will bring down the opacity to 60 the next step is to select the drop shadow blend mode i will keep it multiply and the color i need to select same as the leaf color or we can go for the darker shades then opacity will remain 100 global light need to be checked and angle we need to keep it to 60 degree then distance it will remain 5 size I will increase to 6 and I press the button ok so this is how you create the water effect now to make it more realistic we will apply the liquify I will zoom it a bit and select this forward warp tool and I can resize the shape Okay. so this is the water droplet effect we have created in adobe photoshop hey guys thank you for watching my channel i hope you like the tutorials i'm providing to you please like it share it and subscribe it and put some comments in the comment sections if you have any request for tutorials you can put it down in the comment sections and i will come up in the next tutorial thank you guys